Uh, Lorraine, we know we weren't too happy with your opening round victory over Casey because you know you can play a lot better, but that was a much better game, wasn't it? I felt I was uh, more steady. I was more straight. I didn't have as many uh, loose starts, and that was my aim, was to try and keep them straighter and uh, a little bit higher so I can sort of nick them in as opposed to dropping low. So that was, that was the aim to be more steady, I think. Uh, and the opening set of the match, we saw three breaks in the opening three legs. But a bit of a crazy set, really. You know what? I can't tell you what's just happened. I'm, I'm not one for analysing what's just gone on. I just look at the score and, and, and just take it from there, I think. And I think Trina put quite a lot of pressure in that second set. You were tuning up and, and she really she really got it back to two all and she had darts to win that set. That's what Trina does. She digs in and she just puts the right scores in at the right time. And when that's happening, all you can do is you hope that she misses and she gives you a shot and, and you've got to try and capitalise on that. I was ha quite happy with my finishing, obviously on some shots where I needed to take it out. Um, so still, there's still more in the tank, there's still more to come, oh, promise. Uh, and <laughs> but that, I'm happy to win. <laughs> uh, and of course that, you hit the bullseye and to, to win the leg with that fantastic, what was it, 127 was it, 124? Four, was it 124? 124 shots, sorry. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Amazing shot away. Thank you. <laughs> um, what just what's your reaction to that? Because to take out a shot like that to win a game it must take some nerve. It does. And I've got an awful habit of and I don't some players like have a celebration and I'm not a celebrator, it just it's whatever happens and I've got an awful habit of clapping my hands and when I clap my hands I'm like, oh that's tingling a bit. <laughs> Yeah, and I didn't actually realise it's only the second time you'll have made the semi-finals at Lakeside. It is, yes. I lost out to Dita last time and it went all the way to sudden death leg, which was awful. <laughs> so uh, a little bit of a new experience up there then for you, maybe? It is, but I'm going to relish it and um, face whoever, whether it be Anastasia or Aileen. Um, like I said uh, in my previous interview, I've come with my eyes on the prize, as we all have. So I think that's the thing is to just try and stay focused.